Hello everyone, welcome to another Blowhard Plays. Today I'm playing this cool game called Hue. It said controller recommended, so I'm going to use a controller. Let's go. Ooh, I'm a ghosty person. So I've collected a little letter. Dearest Hue. Oh, I've had the most dreadful luck. I feel terrible that you've been left alone at this time. Oh, I've been left alone. Dr. Gray oh, to that the evil Dr. Grey. A ring I developed to allow That's not good. Of alteration of color. Ooh, alteration Some of color. There's no color in this game. <laughs> impossible for Dr. Grey, maybe. Anyway, something went wrong. I turned a stone I wonder what went wrong. Yeah, I do look kind of the invisible ring, it, it fractured, in this game. Scattering colored shards far and wide. I stayed at home for many weeks, watching, waiting, existing on this coloured plane. I yeah, couldn't it's speak just so grey here. There's no colour at all. With anything in the mono world. So I left. And it's just kind of random corridors that I guess I I'm supposed to run along while waiting for this. The tools I had created. Waiting for this I pray text. You have found what is left of the ring. Oh, there she is typing there. Ooh, what's that on the right? Some weird thing with a staff. And what's down there, I wonder? Deep, dark pits. Okay. Uh, somewhere else now. It's all a dream. Okay, it's all fine. Just waking up in my normal grey world. It's all a dream. It's all fine. I think that should be cool then. Okay, I'm up. What's outside? Rain? A little bird. Cool. A boat. A house. Now I think I want to go to the boat. Boats are more interesting than houses. There's a boat, some sea, some cages, a man. Let's talk to him. The fisherman caught a glimpse of something. Something unusual. Down past the lighthouse. Okay, what's down past? This is, that looks like a lighthouse. Oh my god, it's a colour. It's blue. I see some colour. That's like really nice colour. Ooh, I think I've unlocked something. I think it's blue. Another letter. Since the beginning, we have pointed to the sky and declared it blue. Yeah, the sky does look pretty it blue. This shared vision, this unquestioned understanding which connects us. It's in the lighthouse. Oh, there's some green. Really seeing blue the same way I see it. Perhaps blue is nothing more than a shade of grey to you. Perhaps everyone in this world sees nothing but shades of grey. Don't you see, Hugh? This. Okay, this so we're here to we're get here. colours, but there's no... I don't have any green yet, but I do have blue. Can I do anything yet? It doesn't seem like it. So yes, yeah, so people watching, I haven't played this game before. I'm just kind of seeing what happens and exploring a little. Maybe I should have gone in the houses, but I'm sure it's fine. Let's just go down here and see what we find. What's through here? A grey cave in a grey world. There's some blue though. And a miner. Hello? Hugh? Is that you? Thank goodness. I've been trapped for days. Help me get out of here. I keep hearing noises creeping me out. I can use R. Oh cool, then I can select a colour. And if I select that colour it disappears? The rocks, they... they just disappeared? I don't know how you did it. Who cares? I'm saved. Thank you. Okay, so I can like show people colours and then things will disappear. That is interesting. Let's see. I can't get down there because I only have blue. What else is up here? Water. And a door. Some more blue. When you enter a cave expecting a waterfall, the chances are your expectations will be met. Yeah, there seems to be a lot of waterfalls in these caves. Expectations. Don't you think instead the cave will be full of surprises? I'm trying to see if you can jump up, but it's just a waterfall. To abandon your expectations. Okay, so I shouldn't have any expectations. To pull from the brink of and pull someone back from the brink I of your reality. Got it. The world, not for what it is, but for what it can be. Okay, I've got to see the world for what it can be. Which at the moment is just a load of long corridors, but you know, I'm sure it's fine. The world is being a lot of long corridors. Ooh, a door. I wonder where it leads. 
Oh, another long grey corridor. Who looks a person? Oh, hello there. You startled me. I'm just resting my legs. Don't play too close to the water now. I'm gonna fall in the water to see what happens. Oh yeah. Yeah, pretty obvious I die or, you know, respawn. Or something like that. Really nice music this game though. So let's get rid of the blue wall by selecting blue. I imagine this can lead to some interesting puzzles. But now we just go through another grey door. Okay, more blue. So it's kind of introducing us to the way we can get across blue. Ooh, what's this? There's a crate which I can hold X to pull. Okay, so it's got pulling crate mechanics too. Okie dokie. Now what? Wait, I think I want it over here. Probably. Wait, and then I can't get up there. Ah, that's not right then. I'm already being puzzled by these simple puzzles. There we go. But then, how do I get the crate over there? Hmm. See, I need the crate to be over there. Oh, I see. I just go like this. Makes perfect sense now. <laughs> sure, it took me three attempts because I'm so smart. Okay, so down there's a evil things. So I reckon if I move the crate about here. Yes, this works. I don't get crushed by boulders or impaled by spikes. Which, you know, is a pretty way, good way to spend a day not being crushed by boulders or impaled by spikes. Okay, so I think I need to start over here. But how do I get up there? Oh, cool, you can cut. Time slightly freezes. Oh, wait, I needed to unselect blue, didn't I? Yes, that makes sense. Wait, what? Yes, okay. I think I understand this. You can do like really cool mid air color changes. So I go like this, then unselect blue. No. Why didn't that work? Okay, I think. I don't know if I can make things reappear. I think I have to have another color to make things reappear, which is a bit of a shame. So I can't access that ladder until I unlock more colours. Got it. More water, more boulders. Let's try not to get crushed. Ow. Nope. I broke my neck. Maybe if we stand up here. That makes much more sense. There we go. Now I'm not going to die. Which door though? I'm going to pick this one. Because it's the harder one to get to. Oh, there's just a load of boulders. That's not good. Maybe if we move this out of the way. Yes. Oh, I know that other door in the last room was just the one I came through. We can go through a load of boulders. There's also, in addition, another door which I... Uh, these ladders, which I don't seem to be able to access. Oh, now here I think I need to grab that and run. Yes, this is a challenge. I have to beat the boulder down the hill. Okay, I see. This is getting pretty entertaining now. No, don't crush me. <laughs> oh, and I <laughs> I managed to land in the spikes. How dumb. Let's do that again, shall we? And not land in the spikes. Do I even need to use the ladders? It doesn't feel like it. I can probably break my legs. Otherwise, why would they even have ladders? That's what I'd like to know. Or maybe it's just if I want to get back up. Oh god, I did it again! Sorry, I'm going to do it again, and I won't fail this time. It's fine. Let's do this. Do, 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 do. Wee. Splat. Let's not land in the spikes this time, guys. Okay. There we go. Ooh, a bottle. I've got a bottle. Oh. Is that all that's down here? Weird. Do I have to go back up? Okay, I'll head back up. Oh, there's a ladder. Okay, let's head up the ladder. Into another grey corridor. And a man. What does he want? It's so mysterious. Okay, that was a mysterious encounter. I think it's grey in this one. I want it to be blue. Let's make it blue. Blue looks nicer than grey. Ooh, stairs. Purple! Another colour! Oh my god, yes, a second colour. So perfect. So pretty. 
Wow. Shrinking violet. Sorry, apparently it's violet. Because I got an achievement which you can't see, but it's fine. Apparently that's violet, not purple. Oh, there's nothing here. Oh, but if I go into the violet dimension, there's a door that's violet. So they're not all grey doors anymore. Oh my god, this is getting more complicated. Here we go. Another letter. Did you know, Hugh, that purple is at the very end of the visible spectrum? Um, I it's knew the that. It's colour yeah. for our eyes to distinguish. Wow. Now, imagine a shade one step further than purple. A colour beyond what we can actually perceive. We call these impossible colours. And I fear that this... This is where I currently reside. Oh, so this person who I think is supposed to be my character's mother is in impossible colours. Do I even exist to you? That is a good I'm question. Sure that I do. I mean, but there seems to be letters. You're reading this letter, or, or at least I hope you. Well, I seem to be reading this letter. I'm sorry, but I just lie around in these caves. Existing in this strange state of impermanence it does funny things to you, Hugh. It makes you question what is real. Okay, what is real? That's a real question. And a blue door. Now, here we go. If we look here, we can see all everything. So we need to do purple there. So basically, the colour you select is the one you can't see. So if we do this, see? Now, this is getting into the good puzzling stuff. Great, okay. Now, we want to not see blue. Now you want to not see purple, not see blue again, oops, we need to be over here, not see purple again. And there's a purple crate here, which may be of use to me. Anything else? No. Oh, I see, I can then not see the crate again, and I can make it exist, and I can do this. Now that's getting pretty cool, isn't it? I mean, come on. Okay, blue. And then we make blue exist again. And now I'm guessing there's a purple crate here. Oh, this is going to be tricky. Oh my god, we have to change colours in mid-air to make the crates appear. Isn't that getting cool? And then there'll be a door that I can't see because I'm in the wrong colour. Now this game actually has some pretty cool... It's kind of a puzzle platformer. So it has some pretty cool mechanics. Like you can do things like change in mid-air. Like that, and then I think I need to jump onto there. What else is there? And you can just kind of hold down randomly and you'll see what's there. Okay, so I want to go over to that blue one, I think. Or not. There we go. What else is. What's next? Over here, I think. Then over to this purple one. Now where? Up. I think I can jump directly up. Yep. There we go. This is actually really cool. Don't you see? You have to kind of do puzzles. And I don't even have to jump on all the blocks, but I made it. To, we've started into the proper puzzles now. The two different colours. Oh, this guy again. What does this guy want, I wonder? He's wandering off now. That's a bit rude of him when I'm trying to talk to him or stare at him. Oh, does this mean we're going to get another colour? Orange! Isn't that great? This is going to make the puzzles even more complicated now with three, three colours. I've got orange. Okay, let's do an orange puzzle. Okay. So everything's really orange now. It's actually kind of hurting my eyes. I'm going to go up to blue. The orange is hurting my eyes. I don't like it that much. This room is massive. And then back to a tiny little cave. Of course. The university gardens were bathed in an earthy orange light when I first met Dr. Gray. Summer had come and gone in a cold autumnal crispness that caught me off guard. That was a pretty cool puzzle, the three colours. I colors. sat on the grass, surrounded by my books and papers, when a cool breeze threatened to blow my notes across the lawn. Ooh, cool the breeze throwing notes. My reach and took flight. Flying paper, a that's man just not weird. much older than myself chased after it, catching it on his third or, or fourth attempt. I remember his gentle smile. Ooh, more puzzles. He started talking and I was surprised that he had read my work in the university Oh, journal. is this going to be Dr. Gray? He said he was a professor and 
that he hoped I reckon it might be someday. the person that like made everything bad it's and stole funny. the colors from the world so or something like that can change so much oops I made the door disappear there we go let's get the door back to appear again what's down here a pile of blue rocks oh my god are we back here again we're back at the start that is great so if we then go down here Yes, if we then go down here, there's more puzzle. Okay, that's cool. Then we go down here, I guess. Into the next layer of the thing. But I think I've shown you guys a decent amount of hue. I've got three different colours. I really suggest you check it out yourself. I'm incredibly enjoying it. I mean, I just got it in a bundle somewhere for like practically nothing, but it's great. I'm actually enjoying it. I, I would recommend it. Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Blowhard Plays. Goodbye.